for the fixers. They're standing by to get their new test subject. Move along. Nothing to see here. Hello everyone, this is Jason from Force Hammer Gaming, back with our playthrough of the Watch Dogs Legion Bloodline DLC. So for this video, I'm actually going to complete as many of these fixer contracts as I can. So let's start with this one, the, and we'll get the Shredder Senpai, um, looks like a machine gun. So, let's do that. I heard you're in need of my particular set of skills. Something like that. There's a high-band EM cloak signal popping up all over London. It's more powerful than anything on the open market right now, which means it's worth a lot to the right people. We need you to track it down. That's all? Easy. Well, maybe. The thing's bouncing around between half a dozen different locations, and I can't get a beat on it. If I had to guess, I'd say it's some kind of cloaked vehicle. Uh, hold up. Did you say ghost car? No one said ghost car. Sweet! I'll do it. No further info required or wanted. Okay. So where... Okay, I guess I have to... Okay, it's in this general direction. Maybe I'll take this here. See if I get any closer. Oh. Where's the... Okay, there we go. Okay. Still over here. Maybe... A little bit closer here. Uh, it must be a moving card because I'm standing still and it seems okay I'll go here and then I'm going to take a car in the next area yeah it's getting closer and closer now I need to find a vehicle of some kind hello Excuse me. No. Oh wait, was there somebody in this car? Would have would assume that somebody would be, um, you know, like yelling or something if some stranger came in. Unless this is a automated car. Okay. Anyways, weaker, stronger. Okay, so it's in this general direction. Nope. Nope. Okay, got to turn around. Excuse me. Pardon me. Jump out of the way. Yeah. Excuse me. Thank you. Much, much closer. Excuse me. Nope! Oh, sorry! I don't see the car. Wait, is that good or bad? You're definitely near a cloaking field. Look for a kind of shimmering, blurry space. I see it. Like when you get a migraine. Oh, I've never had one of those. Really? Try talking to you sometime. Find the ghost car! Except it doesn't have wheels, doors, a back seat, or an engine. Oh. Must be made out of the same material as the car. An early prototype, maybe? Or another tormented spirit haunting the streets of London. Ooh. The only one being tormented here is me. Get to the next location. Okay, you're the boss. Okay, this way... Roundabout. Oh, so, sorry. 
who's the buyer? Not telling. Fuck off. Not even a hint? They're paying for their anonymity wrench. Oh, that explains why they want an invisible car. Okay, turning left. Yikes. One way street. Excuse me. Ah, I think it's on the other side. Okay. No. No. Okay, definitely going away from it now. Okay, it is this direction. Hmm. Excuse me. Maybe it's down this street. Okay, it's gotta be close by. Ish. No. Left or right? Oh, sorry. You're still good. Ah, it's down this way. Or not. It's this way. The ghost hunters of London are on the scene. Legend is, a car was brutally murdered here, 20 years ago to the day. That's the lore? It's the ghost of a car? Spirit, if you can hear me, rev your engine! Okay, looking for the predator shimmering. There we are. Huh, it's a lot closer to the EM field we're looking for. But the shape is... off. Oh, come on, you can say it, Jordy. It's a ghost toilet. It's another prototype is what it is. Makes sense, this is experimental tech after all. Hey, would you mind muting me for a sec? I need to void my ghost bladder. So when you say experimental tech, who exactly has been doing the experimenting? You don't need to know, and I don't want to tell you. Oh, come on, man. It could help me find the ghost car. Oh, yeah? The Ouija board's not doing it for you? Excuse me. Okay, left. Yes. I see it. Move. I'm targeting you instead of the car. It's escaping! Come back! Stop doing the fucking ghost car bed and start chasing the car. Christ, eyes on the road, wrench. It's getting away. Yes, I see it. Get back here, you greased up little hog. I'm in range. Trying to disable the auto drive now. Steady, steady. And almost. Gotcha. All right, get in the car before it drives off again. Can I keep the ghost car? I mean, the cloak car? I'm in. Does my voice sound invisible right now? You know what? I know you want me to ask you what invisible sounds like, and I'm not gonna fucking do it. Radio when you're at the drop point. Okay, well, can I just say, I love this feisty will they, won't they dynamic we have going on. It's just the... Hello? Jordy? Nah, he's not into our sense of humor. Well, wrench his sense of humor. Jordy! 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 What? What? I was just wondering what you're gonna do with the ghost car. Oh. My. God. None of your goddamn business. Okay, because I've got a really weird idea. Oh, and if you're wondering if it's a sex thing... No, Jordy, okay? Way weirder. I'm literally this close to putting out a hit on you.
Oops. People are seeing pylons and poles flying, wondering what's happening. Ah! Something just hit the, that van! Or I think it's a van. Whoops. Excuse me. Okay. Well, we solved the mystery of the ghost car. And we did it together! Sure. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going to spend the rest of the day firing an assault rifle and screaming. Excellent. I'm gonna... Let's see... You know Yes. Whoops. Don't want to take that out. Okay. Wrench. Edit. Let's... Yes. Okay, so next mission is Laddie. So we can reach, uh, hack robots. Hey there, Plunger. Ready for some more action? It's Wrench. Gesundheit. So, how'd you like to help the Fixers turn Rempart's robot army against itself? Color me intrigued. What are we gonna do with those rascally robots? Not robots, plural. Just one. Our clients have been itching to take one of those babies apart. Find out how backdoor friendly they are. Maybe eventually turn the entire fleet against Rempart. You know, the usual Saturday night shenanigans. So you're talking about a robo heist. <laughs> now that I can get behind. Good. My contacts have found a Mark I robot being housed at the Albion Defense Facility. An older model, but good enough for our purposes. And the place is ripe for infiltration. <laughs> Their routers still use the admin username. Well, it has been a while since I've done any tinkering. Let's robo heist. Okay, so let us go to... Right over here. Okay, maybe I will have to take a car. Excuse me. Don't cross the street like that. Excuse me. Whoa. Ah, so much damage. So this is where our lucky killer Cylon is being housed. Cylon. I guess awesome. these suckers are everywhere now. Let's do this. The bot is connected to an access point on a nearby roof. I hope you didn't leave your toys at home, big boy. Drone job. Got it. Hello. Okay. You know, we never actually discussed any plan or strategy or anything for this. Just saying. Just connect to the bot, deliver oh, what's to the this? pickup location, I'll send you. I'll Something over the there. Drone. Don't let... Remote operator detected. Manual override engaged. Don't blow my cover, dog! If anyone asks, you're just an ordinary robot going about your ordinary robot business. And if that doesn't work, then we'll figure it out together. By your command. Wait, wait, wait. Nice. So you Cylon talk. Like talk. A new Cylon? And you talk like an old Cylon? <laughs> Jackpot! Ha, <laughs> yes. By your command from the original 70s Battlestar Galactica. But where do I go now? Oops. Okay, do I just walk through? Nope. Okay. Oh, I guess I have to destroy this. Ah, it's hard to control this thing. There's no strafing. 
So what, do I do something with this? No. Or do I go through that door? Oh. Okay. I guess I go through this door. Ah! No. Turn around. Okay. Operator status verification requested. Dude, I said don't blow my cover. If anyone finds out you've been hacked, it's no more robo heist. Just lie and say you're bugging out or something. You can lie, can't you? Not by your command. What? Oh, oh, I see what you did there. <laughs> Good girl. I mean, I, I'm assuming you're a girl. Whatever, gender's a construct anyway. I am bugging out. This is a bug. Man, I can't wait to introduce you to Rex Jr. Name not recognized. Please restate. What, Rex Jr.? Oh, now nah, he's cool. And I'm sure he'd love to have a little sister. Oh, uh, wait, I'm handing you over to, to the fixers to be dismantled. By your command. Yeah, by my command. I am not being operated remotely. I am doing this myself. Hey, screwdriver. How's the robot handling? Oh, she's fine. She? And then? What? Can I help you with something? I'm a little busy here. Easy, Tiger. Getaway drone's on its way. From there, you'll deliver the robot to the fixers. They're standing by to get their new test subject. Move along. Nothing to see here. Okay, I guess this way... Turn... Ah! Somebody behind me? Yep. Move along. Nothing to see here. Okay, Jordy. I'm here. Yep, I can see you. Just get the robot under the drone and I'll pick it up. Okay. Come on. Whoops. Disregard my actions. I am an ordinary robot. Yes, you are. Okay. Compliance is mandatory. Rest mode activated. Good girl. Anyone tries to shoot down that drone, I'll shoot him down first. By your command. Don't get too attached, crowbar. I got fixers at the drop-off site waiting to take this thing apart. Yeah, about that. Uh, I think I'm just gonna take the robot to the safe house and keep her for myself. Cool, cool, cool. You're stealing the robot? Are you fucking kidding me? I know, but here's the thing, okay? I can't stand by and let her be dissected like a frog in biology class. I can't let that happen to Renchalina. Wrench Alina. Oh, shut up. I'm still working on her name. Yeah, Wrench Alina is fine. Use a pursuit intervention technique. Man, Albion are not letting up. They must be pissed. You think they're pissed? The fixers won't hesitate to kill you for breaking their contract, and then they're gonna be pissed at me because I'm gonna kill you first. Uh, can we put a pin in that? I'm trying to save Renchel. I think I preferred Renchelina. I don't know. Renchel works too. Right, close this fucker down. Actually, how far away am I? Nope, still there. Jordy? You still there? Oh, yeah, I'm still here. Just thinking about which orifice to stab you in first. Okay, look, I can get you and the fixers the data you need without hurting Francesca. She and I have spent a lot of time together. I know how she works. By your command. See? You let me adopt her as one of my own, I get you the data you want, and we all walk away with our orifices untouched. Deal? I'll call you back.
Somebody shooting me? And wish this thing could go faster. Okay, sir. Hmm. Okay, I think I can maybe cut through here. Almost there, or not? Gonna just have to maneuver around these buildings. Right, and then another right. Wrench, my fixer contact has accepted your proposal. Get us the data we're after, and you can keep Wrenchalina or whatever you're calling that fucking thing. Thanks, Jordy. You're a real mensch. And as a token of my gratitude, I have decided on the name for this little lady. No. In honor of you, Jordy Chin, I hereby name this robot Little Jordy. You know, I really don't like you. That guy has no sense of humor. Oh, there he is. Hello. Can you talk? Mission complete. Hey there, little Jordy. Wrench Jr. You showing your baby sister around? Yeah? Getting along? No fights? <laughs> okay. Atta boy. Daddy loves you both. Okay. Anyways, let's see. Next. Okay. Faster than leet. Wrench, have you heard of this annual London hackathon? Wait, 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 wait. Do you mean the ultimate extreme mega insanity elite hackathon powered by Space Bull Power Drink? Uh, yeah, I've heard of it. Well, this year, some guy sponsored by Rempart is participating. And if Big Rich Tech Guy wins, some of the best hackers won't want to sign up next year. Fucking Rempart. The scrub won't even race himself, so he paid someone else to do it. You think he's providing this guy with unauthorized racing gear? Yeah, probably. There's no hard evidence, though. Shit. Well, either way, this should be an easy clap. Glad you're on board. Why don't you head over? Okay. And we are going right there. Let's reach the Hecathlon registration. Just take this car. I should probably should use this. Oops, sorry, sir. Take a quick peek here. Uh, okay, cannot go through there. Whoops, sorry. Jordy, I'm looking at the leaderboard here. This Rad's crony must be loaded up with all kinds of crazy tech. There's no way he could have gotten these times without cheating. Well, 
You still think this will be an easy clap? Oh, it needs to be. There's no way I'm letting Mr. Big Corporation win. Okay. Man, I was almost expecting a crowd. Running through a race course alone doesn't have the same hype. Imagine the chaos if the contestants ran the course together. I don't think Space Bull Power Drink wants people dying on their watch. Right. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's get that dub. Okay, start race. Let's go! Oh. Whoa. Nice one. I've got to be the best pirate you've ever seen. So it would seem. Nice pyrotechnics. Almost there. Stay sharp. You still have two more courses. Whoa. Ran into that other boat. I'm going to assume so, that the I third course is... To beat my time. Well, I can promise you won't win with your shoddy tech. Actually, I will win with my tech. And unlike you, you little corporate sellout, I don't need to cheat. Uh, Wrench, isn't that car-stopping hack kind of like cheating? What? <laughs> no. <laughs> Shut up, Jordy. Yes. Anyways, I have a feeling that the third uh, course will probably be drone flying. Turn. You can't let this guy win. You need to pick up the pace. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I know. Yeah, this guy's sending all the cars after me. Well, not like directly at me, but just messing him up so it causes chaos on the streets. I hope you're ready for this drone course. It won't be easy. Well. Isn't the only Whoops. One with up their okay. Next. And away we go. You'll never beat me in this drone race. My time was flawless. Good fucking luck, nerd. Thanks, but I don't need your luck. You don't need luck, but you needed to overclock your drone. That seems a lot like cheating, Wrench. Shut up, Jordy! And anyway, this fucker cheated, so doesn't that make this more fair? I agree with that logic. Okay, a little this over a minute. Keep it up. Don't fail me now, little drone. There it is. That's the finish line. You can make it. Go, 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 go. <laughs> Looks like someone's gonna get in trouble with Daddy Rads. Oh, shitting hell. I agree. Sweet. Joan Hack. Nice one, man. Another contract fulfilled. Fuck yes. And it was an easy one, too. Was it easy? You had to cheat to win. Yes, it was easy. And anyway, it was just a minor rule bending. I had no choice, okay? <laughs> well, now your name will be in the ultimate extreme mega insanity elite hackathon hall of fame. Congratulations. Yes, free space bowl power drinks for life. Wonder how those drinks taste. Okay. Anyways, I think that's the last. Oh wait, no, no. Still have one more. Okay. Might as well just do that one then. 
Devin versus Devin. No, no. London Culling. All right, Ratchet, there's the job. It's Wrench. Wrench. <laughs> You're doing this on purpose to antagonize me. Wait a minute. Are you flirting with me, Jordy? Gonna ignore that. Job is simple, so even you'll find it hard to screw up. Client wants you to steal a car. I'm sending you the coordinates. Yeah. Pass. That's boring. Sorry, Monkey Ranch, but the client specifically asked for you. And, oh yeah, they, uh, they're gonna tag along on the job, too. What? Uh, I'm not some glorified babysitter. Uh, they paid a ludicrous amount of crypto to ensure that today you are, so get to it. Wait, who's asking for me? Is it a trap? Jordy? Jordy! Yeah, it might be a trap. But anyways, let us go to it. See if there's a vehicle I can steal. Something here on this side, no. Nope. Looking for what? Is there something automated? Okay, this'll do. There you go, three point turn. Yeah, I think when I'm looking at the windshield, they, there's an A on it. So those are the cars that I'll take. So I don't have to accidentally steal along with the person inside. The mission. Excellent. Step one is underway. Um, for the record, I'm an unwilling participant in whatever deep throat fantasy you're acting out of here, dude. Deep what? That's gross, man. No, it, it's an X-Files thing. I, you're gross. Whatever you say. The car I want you to steal should be nearby. Who the fuck are you? And why are you using a voice modulator? Ask the guy who's also using a voice modulator. Get the car, and maybe you'll find out. Ooh. God, it's making my eyes bleed. I love it. Wait a minute. That music? This car? Are you... Oh my god! Don't tell me! You can't be! You know it, baby! It's the epic wrench and Marcus crossover the people have been asking for! Marcus? Marcus! Marcus! Ah, oh, shit! That's almost better than what I thought! Wait, who the fuck did you think I was? I won't lie, I was kind of hoping you were Jimmy Siska. <laughs> no, but I do have a surprise planned for you in that vein. This car is the car Jimmy Siska drives in the upcoming Devin Von Devin movie. Devin v. Devin. London Culling. Oh my god! Is Jimmy Siska gonna jump out of the trunk? No, Reggie, you're killing me here. Drive to these coordinates and I'll fill you in. Alright, so first off, you going AWOL without a word to your boy was rude. You're gonna apologize to me later for making me worry about your stupid ass. Yes, Mom. Now... Tell me what my surprise is. Please, please, please! So remember when that teaser for Devin v. Devin London Culling dropped? Oh, hold on one sec. Finally, oh, Devin sorry. Von Devin was gonna return to our screens! Facing off against his evil British clone, Devin Van Devin. I gotta get there. In an epic there. showdown of Devin. Excuse me. Yeah, but after the London bombings, filming got shut down and they couldn't finish the movie. Yeah, they were missing a few big stunts. But the car and all the sets are still here. Oh my god! You don't mean... It's up to us. We're gonna film those stunts and finish the movie. Fuck yeah, we are! Okay, would have driven earlier, but I was just listening to the conversation. In a world in need of a hero, one man stands in the way of humanity's destruction. Jimmy Siska returns as Devin Vaughn Devin. I am back, baby. In his directorial debut, Siska brings Devin Von Devin to the merry streets of England. 
where he faces off against his greatest adversary yet. I think you're seeing double. His glow, secretly grown from his DNA by the sinister spy agency Elite Shadow Force. Devin Van Devin. How can I defeat myself? Huh. The epic showdown is coming soon in Devin V. Devin, London Calling. Oh, shit! That sounds so good! I am at half mast! Okay, too much information there. That doesn't damage the car too much, excuse me. So, guess drive up here. No, oh. that's okay, just drive up right here. And... Well, any guess what we're about to do here? I see a ramp. I see a car. And if the answer isn't, we're gonna jump a car, I'm never speaking to you again. Hell yeah, we're gonna jump a fucking car. Okay, so jump a car. Uh, toggle flashlight. Okay, do I hack it? Ford! Yay! And... Yippee-ki-yay, motherfucker! Yeah! I got a nice angle on that, too! That, uh, that, that, that car's not insanely expensive or anything, right? I'm sure it'll buff out. Whoops. Was I out of range? We've got some more shots to do. Let's roll. Okay. Where's the car? Okay. Range and his BFF Marcus. Going to blow stuff up. Yeah, yeah. Going to Cyber 2 Driver. Gonna be friends with Jimmy Siska. Okay. It's Wrench again, huh? So how did you know I was in London? Just because you stopped talking to everybody doesn't mean I didn't keep tabs on you. After you split... Hold on. With... He who must not be named... And can fall down a well. Yeah, touchy subject, I know. I won't put you on blast for it, just... Are you alright? What are you doing here? I had unfinished business with Rampart. Remember that asshole? But right now... I'm gonna blow some stuff up and live out my Devin Von Devin fanfiction, and it's gonna be so epic! Hey, he's back! Let's light it up! Okay, almost there. Hopefully I didn't actually need to bring that, uh, okay. car. This is the part of the movie where Devin clashes with Devin in their first big action set piece. A showdown of epic proportions. I can do a bigger boom. Let me have fireworks, please. Hey, you gotta run through and arm all the explosives that are set up. You need to be fast, though. If you take too long, they'll automatically disarm as a safety precaution. Speed run! Okay, just gotta get there first. Ah. Okay. There we go. 
arm the explosives. Okay. There we go. Okay, is that good? Okay, got a hack over here. Still not enough. Vault. Come on. I think I'm almost there. Maybe. Ah. It's stuck. Okay. Ooh. Okay, maybe I have to... Okay, is that it? Ah, come on! Nope! Ah! Okay, just gonna cut it close. Yeah, that was good. I got it, Marcus. Hit it. Oh, that's so beautiful. I just came a little. Every time I think I'm used to you. Okay, I want star wipes on this, Marcus. We're making art here. Okay. Anything else? Coming soon in the next chapter of the Devon Von Devon saga. You're not the man I thought you were, Devon. That's because it wasn't me. It was Devon, my evil clone. He has been using my fingerprints to fool the scanner. He has my fingerprints. He is me. Face it, Devin. You're being replaced by a superior version. I don't think so. Nothing beats American made. Okay. Okay, reach the final movie set. Coming soon in the next chapter of the Devon Von Devon saga. You're not the man I thought you were, Devon. I already listened to hey that. Man, do you think there's a chance that Devon v. Devon, London Culling, could end with Devon Von Devon losing? What? No way. There is literally nothing that can take Devon Von Devon down. Except for himself? Huh? Why else did they clone him? Who wins in a death match between Jimmy Siska and Jimmy Siska? It's an impossible riddle! But his clone is not the same as him. It's not actually Devin versus himself. It's like Alien versus Predator. You know who's going to win. Oh, fuck, not this again. The Xenomorph has acid blood, Marcus. It melts through the Predator's armor. Nah, fuck you. The Predator has a stealth cloak and thermal vision and fucking rocket launchers. The Predator is the greatest hunter in the galaxy. The Xenomorph is just big game. I am turning this car around, young man. Okay. Now, maybe I'll use my... Drone. Okay, let's go! 
There we are. Oh shit! Where'd the knockoff Cylons come from? They're Rampart bots. And how do I get this guy off my ass? Well, they look angry and armed. Hey, let's get out of here. Maybe we can find a different place to set up. No way. I'm not letting Rampart take Devin Von Devin away from me too. The show must go on. Okay, in that case, let's. Its CPU temperature is dangerously high. Take down. Huh, he punched that robot. Why did you build me to feel pain? Shockwave charging. Uh oh. Ow. Power supply overheating. Okay, think I can take down. This is my kaboom stick. Woohoo! That's the money shot. Oh, I guess there are robots in Devin v Devin now. Hell yeah, dude. This is like a punch up to the script. Maybe we'll get writing credits for improving the third act. <laughs> you know, I can see us looking fresh as hell on the red carpet premiere. Okay, so next. Oh, okay, I guess that's it. Captain Boom Boom. Perfect. I got all the footage we needed. I'm gonna cut this together and send it to Jimmy Siska's crew. And you'll add Star Wipes? And a banger soundtrack. I got you, Reggie. I'm sorry. <laughs> Wrench. Eh, you can get away with it. You coming home soon? Um, uh, maybe. I've still got to do some stuff here. All right. Well, when you get your scrawny ass back to San Fran, hit me up. Everybody's been waiting to do a full crew hangout on the beach. Now, I won't lie. Sitara might want to chew your ear off for a bit. But it's with love, right? You know, that does sound nice. Thanks, man. You're buying, though. Am I? Yeah, just hurry up over there, all right? And once we get this movie out the door, you better not watch the new trailer without me. Mark it in your calendar. You, me, Devin, and Devin. I love you, man. I know. All right, mission complete. Here you go. Give me one second. I'm just going to take a quick picture of this. Okay. And. Okay, that looks pretty cool. Alright, is there any more missions? No, just the main mission and these resistance missions that are locked. So I think I finished all the missions for Wrench. All the side missions anyways. Okay, so you know what? I think this will be a good place to end off this video. So I hope you enjoyed watching this edition of the Watch Dogs Bloodline, uh, Watch Dogs Legion Bloodline. Uh, DLC. As always, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and be sure to check out my other, so my other social media accounts in the description below. Until next time, this is Jason from Force Hammer Gaming, signing off.